Hey guys, today is Tuesday, October 10th, 2017. It's time for Bible Opposite. My name is Timothy Andrew Antonio Kevin, and I'm going to be your host for the next uh, couple of minutes, uh, give or take. Alright, so first off, let me explain to you how Bible Opposites became to be. Well, the biggest opposite, uh, obvious, is I'm bipolar. So, that's right there. But I thought, you know what? I got an interesting name for my series. Just, you know, that'd be something cool. So, I adopted bipolar opposites. So, polar opposites, bipolar opposites. Fun! Then also, I had to go through several iterations of this show. Really, to get it right. I mean, I did news stories. I did random topics. I did all kinds of stuff that just wasn't right for the show. So, I decided, you know what? Get back to what it should be. Bipolar opposites. Yeah. I mean, really, that doesn't sound like it needs news. You know? So what I've been doing is, I've been taking, taking topics from you. Saying what you want to see on the show. So, of course, there's whatever, likes, follow, share, whatever you want to do on this page. That's fine. Or, you can email me at bipolaropposites119 at yahoo.com. Now, of course, here's the thing. This is the index. The index came from all these interviews I did. Because let's face it, I'm trying to get topics, so I had to do interviews about certain topics to certain people. So I've been asking around, saying, you know, what to use in this, what, you know, all kinds of uh, interesting things. So today in the index, we have. Oh, this came from my therapist. You know, it's always good to have a thing with your therapist if you're bipolar. So, let me read you what she wrote, and we'll call it a day. Mood disorders like depression and anxiety are most common. Statistics say that 30% of all people will have a mood dis di disorder at some point in their lives. I think the percentage is much higher this research can only come, come count those who ad admit to being to getting treatment. Okay, so like I said, I'll do it for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Next time you got in, out.